How are you? How's your mental health? How's my mental health? It's it's solid. It's good. It's very good. Things are proceeding at pace for the greatest challenge of your career, bringing Hamilton to Puerto Rico. <laughs> Lynn Manuel, I have to oh. say, you've come to the Today Show countless times, and every time you come. I see your dad in the background. And now I come to find out you've been keeping a secret from all of us. <laughs> the star has been standing there backstage forever. The whole time. How did it feel to be front and center, the main attraction? Not comfortable at all. I am comfortable promoting a cause, an issue, an institution. My son is much more difficult to spend hours as I have talking about me. <laughs> well, I gotta say, the shoe on the other foot is so comfortable. <laughs> I, will, I will tell you what has helped me go through this period. I tell myself, remember, they'll tell you your story, but it's the story of every migrant, every immigrant mm -hmm. who comes to this country who have to work hard. Then I calm down and I do my part. Throughout, we're hearing about the heart attack and everyone's monitoring your heart and how's he doing? And I'm watching your wife, Louise. She's like, please slow down. She's practically begging you to sleep, but you don't stop. Right, because I'm fine. I am the healthiest in my home. I eat well, I do exercise every day. I take my pills and I don't need a lot of sleep. I tell Luz all the time. Don't blame me that you have to sleep seven hours when I don't. Lynn, this is where you step in and wag your finger. <laughs> yeah. Um, sleep helps a lot. Um, I he know. Not think he needs it, but it helps his mood. Yeah. And that helps the rest of our lives. <laughs> to be easier. When he comes in, Ling Manuel, we have to talk about, I stay. Good morning. How are you? <laughs> I already said good morning yesterday. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm going to say good morning from now on, on January 1st, <laughs> for the rest of the year. I did not realize this, Lynn. I did not know that Alexander Hamilton, by the way, you were channeling your dad the whole time you were on the stage. First time I'm thinking past tomorrow. So what traits do those two share? Um, I think it's a certain relentlessness. You see it in the documentary, but... He, you know, he, he doesn't even have patience for sleep. Um, so when I was playing him, when I was reading Chernow's biography of Hamilton, I, I recognized that that was a trait uh, not far from my family tree I could draw from uh, for, for my performance as Hamilton and as I was writing him. So, Luis, when, when, when watching this, you realize that trying to bring Hamilton to Puerto Rico to raise money was an incredible feat. There was one scene that struck me and Lynn manuel was on stage and he was talking about the project to a bunch of cheering people and suddenly up on stage come some protesters and i heard you louise say let them be why uh because that could have been me when i was their age jumping in some stage to make the case for puerto rico or for an issue and i said to myself let them tell their story because their story it's as important as the story that Lin Manuel is telling about raising money for Puerto Rico. You make a beautiful speech where your people are saying, well, why don't you slow down? And you say something like, I'm going to rest, for, rest forever in eternity. You, you're asking the viewer, do you know what eternity is? It's forever. Yeah, he uses that excuse to get out of a lot of stuff he shouldn't be doing. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never forget, we were with uh, a family member on my wife's side of the family. And my dad had his little Bluetooth in his ear. Uh, and this family member said, you know, there's, there's links that show those aren't great. You know, for your brain, there's links to stuff. And, yeah. and my dad said, then I'll live a shorter but more efficient life. Uh, <laughs> uh, do you not great. see where, where, they get, where he gets it, where Lynn gets it? They're an incredible father-son. The, the uh, documentary is amazing. I literally wept through parts uh, of it. His dad lifts you up. Yeah. Um, and he just he's like the American dream. The guy's living it. Well, his zest for life yes, totally feel it. ages. Yeah. I mean, he is no couch potato. Now we now know where Lynn gets it, too. <laughs> he does. He does. We awesome. want to thank, I say again, thanks to Luis and Lynn Manuel. Siempre Luis, it premieres tonight on HBO. It's worth your time watching. That's good stuff.